guys welcome back to my channel so i am beyond excited about what i have for you guys today um i'm going to give you a little hint here's your hint so in sticking with the theme for february which is videos all about inspiration love joy and positivity i have decided to do something for the first time on my channel I have actually interviewed someone, um, and so I'm beyond excited to bring you guys that video and to tell you about an absolutely amazing nonprofit organization that's based right here in Gastonia, North Carolina, which is where I'm living. And I just figured that this would be the perfect time to introduce this nonprofit to my channel. I'm going to link their website as well as their Facebook page down below so that you guys can get more information about them. And with all of that being said, I really hope that you enjoy this video. It's a little different from anything that I've ever done. However, um, I just wanted to spread a little more joy and positivity in the world, which honestly, that's one of the missions of this channel is to just spread awareness, but also to do that in a way that is positive and uplifting for people. So with that being said, I want to jump straight into this video because I am super excited about it and I hope you guys enjoy. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel to give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, and I'll be sure to answer any questions that you have. Um, and let's just jump straight into it. Thank you. Enjoy. Hi, guys. Today we are here with Brittany and Rita from Bunny Blessings. And as I told you guys, this month would be all about um, love and joy and inspiration. And what could better bring love than these two love bunnies we've got here with us today? <laughs> Brittany, would you like to introduce your bunnies? Sure. This is Poppy. She is a lion head bunny. She's got all this fur around her head like a lion's mane. And then Rita is holding Willie. And he is a hollow lock. So he has a lot here. So it's lock. <laughs> So cute. And they are husband and wife. <laughs> what better for the month of February? The love bunny. We yes. brought the love bunny. They love each other very much. Now, um, Bunny Blessings is a nonprofit that Brittany started last year, right? Yes. Okay. And do you want to tell us a little bit about like um, what you guys do and maybe a little about your mission? Sure. We started in July of 2019. And we were just kind of looking for a ministry, a way to share God's love in our community. And we thought, what more of a unique way than taking bunnies around? Um, I've been researching it for a couple of years about animal-assisted interactions, animal therapy, um, and specifically bunnies are non-threatening. Lots of people are scared of dogs. They may find them to be too big or loud. Um, but the bunnies are very soft, calm, quiet, cuddly. Um, so once or twice a week, we take the bunnies to nursing homes, assisted livings, Occasionally the hospital or a school, um, just to spread some joy. Mm -hmm. When people come walking in, they just start smiling. They say, oh, bunny. <laughs> and they want to hold them. They want to pet them. Uh, pet therapy has been shown to lower blood pressure. Mm -hmm. It lowers cortisol, which is a stress hormone. So and we see a big difference, and so does the staff at the places um, and the, the residents there. They start talking more, they start smiling more, they engage with each other, with us, um, with the bunnies, of course. Yeah, and you have some incredible stories on your Facebook page, and I will be sure to link the Facebook page below so that you guys can get a little more information. And just kind of keep up with Bunny Blessings, because I really love the idea of just spreading positivity and joy through the community. And bunnies, I've known you for a little while now, and, and bunnies <laughs> do something that, you know, it's just kind of part of you and something that you enjoy. And I love the idea of taking something that you love and enjoy and using that to impact other people. So I really appreciate that. I've not had the chance to volunteer with you personally, but I follow your story. And, of course, there um, are plenty of opportunities to donate and to help with this amazing cause. And I love that. I just love that even if you don't have the time to volunteer yourself, you can support a local ministry that's doing some really incredible things. I love the story that you posted about how Alzheimer's patients are just coming out of their shell and it helps with memory and socialization. And I think that is just so important. I love that. Rita, how did you get involved with Funny Blessings? You've been there kind of from the beginning, <laughs> huh? I have. Um, I retired from 27 years with the gas company, and Brittany asked me if I would like to help. 
and I have been helping ever since. I fell in love with the bunnies, and uh, Brittany and I were friends before, and so I've just been, this is what I've been doing, and I, and I love it, so. That's how I reel everybody in. You want to come see my money? <laughs> you want to help take care of the bunnies? And I have received more blessings from this ministry um, just to see the smiles on these people's faces, especially whenever we go into, I mean, the children, you know, they get so excited. But my grandmother had Alzheimer's. And to go into the units and the facilities and see what the bunnies do for us, the, the senior citizens that have Alzheimer's is just a blessing. And that's mm -hmm. awesome. Yeah. Yes, my grandmother also had Alzheimer's, so that really resonated with me mm -hmm. as well. Whenever I saw and, and saw your stories about how much it's helping them, I think that's just incredible mm -hmm. because I know when my grandmother passed away, I feel like, well, it's my great-grandmother, um, I feel like I was only 12, so I don't remember a lot, but I feel like she was really lonely, or at least she seemed that way. Mm -hmm. So having something like this is just absolutely incredible. Mm -hmm. and we we have um, some people in the facilities, the nurses, they can't believe when we take the bunnies in, the residents, some of them haven't spoken or said anything, and they see the bunnies, and they start pointing, oh. and they'll just say bunny, and oh my gosh, you know, <laughs> it's, it's just amazing, it, it is, yeah. it's amazing, and they'll start videoing, just so they can send it yeah. to their children, mm -hmm. yeah, how they can that. see, yeah, I'm sure, I mean, it impacts the patients, the staff, the families, mm -hmm. like you guys are doing an amazing, amazing we had a lady actually. We recently she told the story of a lady who hadn't spoken to her daughters the whole visit they'd been there, and I think for a few weeks prior to that. But she saw Rita out in the hall with one of her buddies, Buster. Aww. They took her out to see the bunnies, and she was saying, "Oh," and she petted them. And then the daughter said, "I love you, mom," and she said, "I love you too." Oh, but she had not said in months, uh -huh. mm -hmm. and they said that was her last good day. She unfortunately passed away just one day ago. They are so thankful for that mm -hmm. one good day they mm -hmm. had. And we think that Buster and Rita yeah. were a part of that. Yes, I love that so much. Now, how many buddies do you have right now? We have eight. And I say right now because <laughs> you never know. Stay tuned. It's the love month. Oh, man, oh, man. So maybe some big announcements. Oh, <laughs> now, are some of your bunnies, from what I understand, are from Rescues from shelters and things? Yeah, they are all rescue bunnies except for one, our baby shelter. Uh, okay. Yeah, they came from shelters all over the area or Craigslist, people looking to rehome. Mm -hmm. so, um, this one, Poppy, was found wandering around in a field in Charlotte, oh, took her to the shelter. That's why we named her Poppy yeah. after a wildflower. And Willie came to us from a rescue in Asheville, North Carolina for the wolf rescue. Oh, yes, I remember that. I remember that story. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, I do want to say thank you so much for just taking this little bit of time to talk with me and to let everyone know what you guys have been up to. Um, I love this idea. I love spreading joy. And like I said, you're using something that you're passionate about. <laughs> and you being such an amazing <laughs> friend and coming on board. Uh, I, right. I love this story. I really do. And it's really cool to me because I've always wanted to be part of a nonprofit. So it's cool to me to see someone that I personally know. Because <laughs> like a lot of times people seem larger than life when they do something that's incredible. And so it's really inspiring for me to see what you've done. And hopefully we can inspire some people. You guys have definitely inspired me with this story. And I'm so thankful that you guys took the time. And Willie and Poppy, our love bunnies, came to hang out with us for a little while. Um, we want people to know there's nothing too wacky. If we could take bunnies around to spread joy, whatever your gift is, use it and uh, oh my God. Yes. step out on your limb. Okay. Absolutely. There we go. So I'm going to link the Facebook page, the website. Okay. Um, I want people to be able to keep in touch with you guys. I want everyone to be able to donate if they are so inclined and just to really honestly, like we're all a part of this. Like you said, spread joy in whatever way you can. Right. Um, and I just love it. I love your stories and I love keeping up with the organization. So, thank you. Thank, thank you guys you. so much for joining us. Hey guys, I hope that you really enjoyed that interview with Brittany and Rita from Bunny Blessings. I hope that their mission resonated with you guys as much as it does with me. I really enjoyed interviewing them. I enjoyed loving on the bunnies, of course. And I hope that through this, you were able to learn something and that it just brought a smile to your face, even if just for the period of watching this video, I hope that you felt some joy in your heart. Um, I wanted to tell you guys that this little bunny that was my hint 
in the intro is actually um, a bunny that Bunny Blessings gives out to residents at the nursing homes that they go to. And I just think that that is such a precious thing for them to do and to provide um, for those residents. So if you are interested, I highly encourage you guys to go to their website or go to their Facebook page and donate to this cause. It is so worthy of your time and your donations. And um, like I said, I hope that this has brought a smile to your face. The month of February is the love month. And these bunnies definitely, definitely um, spread some joy and cheer wherever they go. So I hope you guys enjoyed my first ever interview on this channel. And I hope to be bringing you guys some more content soon. So until then, I will see you guys later. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, rest of your week, and a great February. Bye!